There are a lot of factors that make Florida weird. Um, it is not like any other state that I know of in the sense that there is no Florida. I mean, there is Miami, where I live, which is Latin America. Um, there, I mean, it is. I mean, if you spend any time in Miami, you will discover that not only is it Latin America, but it's more and more Latin America every day. Uh, if you go south into the Keys, it's the 60s. <laughs> If you go west to Naples, it's Ohio. Uh, if you go north to Boca, it's Long Island. If you go to, to Orlando, it's like a, you know Russian limousine drivers driving you know tourists from everywhere in the world all, you know around. And if you go much north of that, it becomes Georgia and Alabama. So it is really not one state. It has no coherence at all, um, and, and I think less so as the time goes by. Um, it's a vacation spot, so you have people coming down there just, you know, to have fun. A few people who are not feeling in it necessarily in a serious mood. You have a, it's a very transient state, so you have a lot of people, again, who don't, don't feel rooted there, but are just there because it's, you know, convenient or the weather's nice or whatever. Uh, and it, it's, it's, not, it's a pretty corrupt state. I mean, our, our governments, we've had a lot of corruption in Florida. And, um, and it's convenient to, uh, you know, all kinds of borders. So it's, I mean, it's very easy to get there from the Caribbean, from Latin America, whatever. So if you wanted to smuggle something, Florida is a great place to start. So the result of this is, it's just kind of this very loose, very non-structured, very non-traditional state where anything feels like it could happen. It's kind of like if you made Las Vegas much bigger and with less controls, you know, not the, not the efficiency of the casinos and the Las Vegas Police Department, just a kind of a big area where people feel they can do things. And so you know, people come from everywhere to, to party, to do whatever, to, do commi to commit criminal acts. And it's, the weather's warm, so you can always be outside and, you know, there's always a party going on somewhere. Uh, it's just conducive to weird things happening. Um, my argument has been for a long time that we are not, it's not so much Floridians who are weird, and I consider myself one, I've been there 30 years. Uh, it's, it's people who come to Florida. We are like the Ellis Island for weird, stupid people. They come to, come to Florida to commit stupid acts. If, if, uh, well, one example I like to use, you know, they got an international uh, publicity. A woman was arrested driving south on the overseas highway from Miami to Key, to Key West. Uh, she had an accident um, because she was shaving her bikini region while uh, while driving. Well, she actually had outsourced the steering to her, her passenger. She was in a hurry to see her boyfriend at Key West. This is all according to the police report. Um, so she decided rather than pull over to the side of the road to shave her bikini region, she'd keep going and outsource the uh, steering to her passenger who was, as it happened, and this is why it's a Florida story, her ex-husband. So they're, they're driving south 40 miles an hour. She's shaving but not looking at the road, just operating the accelerator. Here's steering. You know, what could possibly go wrong? Uh, anyway, the car in front of them slows down. They slam into it. There's an accident. International news. They, you, know, can, you know, as all Florida stories are, you know, oh, can you believe it? This woman, she's shaving her bikini area while driving to, you know, the woman was from Indiana. That's the key. She was shaving her Hoosier. Um, so, which is, I think, what that term comes from. But we, Florida gets the blame for that. But it's actually, you know, it's, it's somebody who came to Florida. And that's so often the case. If somebody decides he wants to pleasure himself into a stuffed animal in Walmart, that person's going to, wherever he is, he's going to go to Florida to commit that act. And, you know, this is why we have so many people doing just so many weird things naked with reptiles. Um, we have a lot of reptiles also. So.